the nobel prizes for 2022 has been already provided for all these six categories as you can see on the screen so in this video we will be discussing who got which nobel prize and for what purpose so let us proceed so if you all want all static facts about the nobel prizes and also discussion of all indian nobel laureates then already a video has been uploaded on ssc sikkim as you can see on this thumbnail you can watch this video i'll put it in the description box after this session so let us proceed let us first discuss the nobel peace prize uh, first of all 2022 nobel peace prize have been awarded jointly to one individual and two organizations who is that individual uh, first of all discuss uh, let us discuss that the name of the individual who got the nobel peace prize for this year is a belarusian activist and the name of the activist is alice bialyatsky okay so alice bialyatsky who is from belarus he have got the nobel peace prize and which two other organizations got nobel peace prize they are uh, first of all one is russian human rights organization and the name of the organization is memorial okay so it's a russian human rights organization from russia and the second organization is center for civil liberties okay so first of all uh, belarusian activist he is elis bialyatsky he got the nobel peace prize and uh, in association with uh, russian human rights organization memorial and uh ukrainian human rights organization which is center for civil liberties so all these three have got the nobel peace prize okay so uh, all other prizes is given in sweden and this nobel peace prize is given in norway okay so nobel peace prize is given by norwegian nobel committee in norway whereas other prizes are given in sweden so this was about peace prize first of all one individual who is belarusian activist alice bialyatsky and two other organizations which is memorial from russia and center for civil liberties from ukraine so let us proceed to the next important prize which is nobel prize for literature nobel prize for literature for the year 2022 this year has been given to any ernox and c is a french author okay so any ernox is the recipient of 2022 nobel prize in literature any ernox and for what he she has got she has got for the courage and clinical acuity with which she uncovers the roots estrangements and collective restraints of personal memory so uh, this has been announced by swedish academy for this a uh, particular nobel prize for literature is given by swedish academy so this is it and uh, any ernox is the 16th french writer so before Uh, any and not 15 french writers have already got the nobel prize for literature and she is the 16th french writer to get it and she is the first french woman to get it and 17th female author to get this prize okay nobel prize for literature so this is it next we have nobel prize for medicine 2022 nobel prize for medicine and this is also known as nobel prize in physiology okay so nobel prize in physiology or medicine it has been awarded to a swedish scientist a swedish geneticist who is swanthe pabo okay swanthe pabo remember it he is from sweden and he is the recipient of nobel prize in medicine or physiology and it was announced or it has been given by karolinska institute remember this nobel prize for medicine is given by Karolinska Institute we just saw that nobel prize for literature is given by swedish academy and before this we saw that nobel peace prize is given by norwegian nobel committee in norway so similarly nobel peace uh, nobel prize for medicine it is given by karolinska institute at sweden itself and it has been given to uh, swanthe pavo who is a swedish geneticist and for what did he get this he get this for his discoveries concerning the genomes of extinct hominins and human evolution so remember it next we have nobel prize for economics 2022 so the 2022 nobel prize uh, for economic sciences it has been divided equally between three american economists okay so three economists from america so it's easy for us to remember the countries okay all three are from america itself and who are these economists they are ben s bernanke as you can see in the figure ben s bernanke 
and Douglas W. Diamond, Douglas W. Diamond, and then Philip H. Deepwick. Okay, Philip S. Deepwick. These three people have got the Nobel Prize for Economics 2022. So Ben S. Bernanke, Douglas W. Diamond, and Philip H. Deepwick. So these three people, for what did they get it? They have got this for research on banks and financial crisis. So remember it. So this uh, Nobel Prize for Economics is a unique uh, Nobel Prize among all others. Why? Uh, because it was established later. Okay. Uh, we already discussed in the static video that Nobel Prize was actually established in the year 1901. But then Nobel Prize for Economics was established in 1968 by an endowment in the perpetuity and this uh, has been done by Sweden's central bank and the name of the central bank of Sweden is uh, Sveriges Riksbank okay Sveriges Riksbank so to commemorate bank's 300th anniversary and then onwards this Nobel Prize for economics is sponsored by this bank which is the central bank of Sweden. So Nobel Prize in economics it is given by or it is selected by Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences. So Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences selects the recipients but then it is funded by uh, Sveriges Riksbank which is the central bank of Sweden. So remember these three names Nobel Prize for Economics 2022 Ben S. Bernanke, Douglas W. Diamond, Philip S. Deepwick these three people has been given Nobel Prize for Economics. They all are American economists. Okay, next Nobel Prize for Physics. Three scientists have got again Nobel Prize. Who are they? They are Alan Aspect from France, John F. Clauser from USA, and Anton Zielinger from Australia. So Alan Aspect, French scientist, John F. Clauser, American scientist, and Anton Zielinger, Austrian uh, scientist. Austrian scientist has been awarded with Nobel Prize for Physics for the year 2022. And for what purpose did they uh, receive this prize? For experiments with entangled photons, establishing the violation of Bell inequalities and pioneering quantum information science. So basically it is related with quantum science. So uh, remember it, Nobel Prize for Physics is given to three scientists. Again, I repeat, Alien Aspect, you can see him in the figure okay a smiling face up above with a beautiful moustache and then john f clauser and then uh, anton zelinger who is an austrian scientist uh, again nobel prize for physics it is selected by royal swedish academy of sciences just like nobel prize in economics following this we have the last one which is nobel prize in chemistry 2022 again nobel prize in chemistry has been given to three people who are they caroline r bertozzi martin melzel and k berry saplis so caroline r bertozzi martin melden and k berry saplis caroline and k berry saplis are from united states america and uh, martin melden is from Denmark okay then a scientist these three people have been given Nobel Prize for chemistry 2022 and for what purpose for the development of click chemistry and bio orthogonal chemistry okay so for this they have been given Nobel Prize for chemistry again Nobel Prize in chemistry is selected by Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences so Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences selects Nobel Prize for chemistry Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences selects Nobel Prize for Physics and Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences selects Nobel Prize in Economics. Whereas for Medicine, it is selected by Karolinska Institute. For Literature, it is selected by Swedish Academy and for Peace, it is selected by Norway Nobel Committee. So I hope this is clear. I have condensed all this content in the tabulated form here as you all can see here which will help you revise better so you will get it in the PDF and the PDF of this session is at only rupees 10 and how to get the PDF at rupees 10 just click on the link in the description pay rupees 10 via any payment method and after payment just wait for a little for the PDF to open in a Google Drive link automatically do not press the back button and save the PDF in your device as the PDF will be lost so in the simple steps you get the PDF of this session so I hope the session was fruitful thank you so much don't forget to like share and subscribe to SSC second bye bye